Thank you. Right now, CBS 46 fighting for our veterans. And tonight, we're advocating for a man injured after he was pinned under his car. Yeah, you can see that incredible video of what happened right there. It shows somebody trying to steal his car at a gas station in East Point, but the crime taking a terrible turn, getting even worse, severely injuring that service member. Tonight, CBS 46's Ashley Thompson tells us he is desperate for justice, also help. Glenage, Washington stopped by this BP gas station off of Lakewood Avenue last July. It was a decision that would change his life. 24 year old Glenage, Washington is in the Army Reserve and last July he was also working for a towing company. He says he was on his way to the office when he stopped at this BP gas station to use the restroom. He came out to find a man in his work van. So next thing he did, he looked down and threw it in reverse. Surveillance video captures the moment it happened. The van strikes a cement arch, then flips on its side. Washington gets pinned underneath. I was trying not to pass out. Uh, it was it was painful. It was, it was really painful. The suspect gets away with help from an accomplice. Washington suffers broken bones and a shattered ankle. Nearly 10 months later, he is still in pain. I can't do anything. My, my abilities have been hindered and I don't like that. It, it just it tears me up. Washington says the towing company he worked for did not have insurance and would not pay for the surgery. He says the VA can't help since the incident did not happen on military orders. It stops me from being able to uh, move forward in the military as well. Um, I can't become a sergeant, which I'm a specialist right now. In order for me to do that, I have to complete a PT test. We've contacted Washington's former employer to ask why they did not have insurance on one of their drivers. We've also reached out to East Point Police to get the latest on the investigation. We'll keep working until we get results. And you can see the cement arch is still dented today. Washington has started a GoFundMe to raise money for his much needed surgery. We can connect you to it on our CBS 46 News app. Back to you. Ashley, thank you. And as you know, CBS 46 is fighting for our veterans. If you know of a vet who is not getting the care or benefits they deserve, we really would like to know about it. Call the number on your screen, 404-327-3055, or email fightingforourvets at cbs46.com. We will investigate and work to get results.